Yo, what's up, family? This your big bro? K.O. Tell you, man, listen. There's no excuse. I mean, absolutely no excuse for you not to be living up to your fullest potential. So many people make so many excuses why they're not living up to their fullest potential. People make excuses why they can't find jobs. People make excuses why they're not living up to their fullest potential. I'm telling you, man, you can live to your fullest potential, man. If you're willing to work hard, you can do anything that you put your mind to. There's no excuses, man. I'm tired of all these excuses that people make. Listen, I lost my dad at five years old. I lost my mom at nine years old. I ran away from my aunt house at 14 years old. I got on drugs. I dropped out of high school. I went to prison twice. So there's no excuse. I don't want to hear no excuses, man. People come up, but Kent, I, I, I lost my father. So what? I lost my father. But Kent, I had, didn't have my mother in my life. So what? I didn't have my mother in life. But Kent, I used drugs. So what? I used drugs. Kent, I went to prison. So what? I went to prison. There's no excuse for you not to be living up to your fullest potential, man. The thing about it, you can do anything in life if you put your mind to it. Find out what you want to do in life. Once you find out what you want to do in life, you spend every day, all day, going out to what you need to do, go out to, to be successful, to get to that next level. You can do anything that you set your mind to. Stop making so many excuses, man. All these excuses y'all make is not right. And you can do anything you set your mind to. I don't want to hear no excuses because I could have made plenty of excuses coming up in life, but I didn't. Man, you got to accept responsibility for yourself. You got to accept responsibility through life that you messed up. You messed up. Didn't nobody else mess up. You messed your own life up. So once you start to accept responsibilities for how your life turned out, you can really start to make a change in your life. So start to admit your faults so you can work on it. It's just like Alcohol Anonymous. When you, when you admit that you're an alcoholic, then you know you have a problem, you can admit that. The Bible says confess your sins. If you confess your sins, he is faithful enough to forgive you of your sins. But if you're not, if, if you're not confessing and you're not admitting what you've done, how are you ever going to be able to fix that problem? You have to admit what you have done so you can move on, so you can fix that problem and move on. So many people don't want to admit their faults. Admit your faults, what you've done, 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 so you can move on to that next level. I'm telling you, you can do anything in life that you want. If you're willing to work hard for it, stop making so many excuses. There's no excuse for you not to be living up to your fullest potential. Education, you can get education in all type of ways. They got education on the internet. They got education in books. You can Google some stuff. You can go to conferences. You can get around the right people. Being around the right people plays a major important part in your success. You want to make sure you get around people that are already successful and people that are doing it. See, the thing about it is if you hang around losers, you're going to be a loser. If you hang around winners, you're going to be a winner. So get around people, man, that's already doing it, that's successful. That plays a major part in your life. Listen, man, this your big bro KO telling you, man, you can do anything in life if you are willing to work hard for it. Don't be lazy. You're willing to work hard for it, you can achieve. This your big bro KO telling you, man, you work hard, you can achieve anything in life.